to my sun and stars. Looking back on our relationship, I pause and smile. How could this possibly be my life? I was struggling to love myself. But you held my hand and walked by my side in this journey, and you still are. You helped me love the things about myself I always struggled to accept. It's no secret, you and I met on a dating app. I used to stray away from telling to strangers, but now I love our love story. Michael, I promise to support you and encourage you to love you for the good and the bad, to be your favorite caddy and not distract you on your backswing, to be your forever date while tearing up any and every dance floor you touch, and give you my entire heart until the end of time. don't know me, I'm Isabella, the youngest out of the three of us. I'm also her maid of honor. Victoria has been one of the many women in my life who have inspired and built me into the person who I am today. Yes, growing up, we bickered with each other. At times, it got a little too intense and we would get into physical altercations. But don't worry, no one was hurt. Over the years, I have seen Victoria grow into a stronger woman with Michael at her side. He supports her in all that she does and has given her so much confidence in herself. I think I've had the good fortune of meeting almost everybody here today. My name is Zach Parsons. I went to high school with Michael, or as I call him B-Man, he doesn't really like it, but that's okay. As a third party spectator to their developing love, it was clear that the two of them represent a perfect pairing because each of them complement each other so well. Victoria and Michael will mark their transition as a couple not only by celebrating the love between themselves, but also by celebrating the love between all of us. Slide the fader up now. Love and hate the feedback that they're shaking up that comforts you. Why bother contradicts will melt down. Michael, we are so excited to have you a part of the family. I hope you look forward to all my questions about legal advice. Congrats to the happy couple. Victoria and Michael have chosen a lasso to unify them today. This symbolizes everlasting love and unity in Mexican culture. The lasso is often a string of flowers or rosary beads with two loops to form an eternity symbol. Victoria and Michael are no longer two, but one with new beginnings.
I never imagined I'd be able to open up to anyone like I can with you. With you, I'm comfortable being vulnerable. You inspire me every day with the way you put the needs of others above your own. I know that you will be an amazing mother to our future children, all six of them. <laughs> <laughs> and I promise to be the best father and husband that I can be. By the authority vested in me by the state of Indiana, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. <laughs> I first met him as Brock. He kept to himself and you always wondered, what was he thinking? And all of that changed the night I met Wally. <laughs> and now Wally came out only at night. Wally would hug you and tell you how much he loved you. Fast forward to the first night I met Victoria. And I knew she was the one when I saw all the fun loving qualities that made up Wally whenever you two were together. So let's raise our glasses. To Brockman, B-Man, Wally, best friend, and now husband and Victoria, I love you both so much, and I couldn't be more happy for you in the future you will have. Cheers. <laughs>